My dear, can I share something with you that I've never expressed before? It's a truth I've kept inside for too long, and I feel it's time to say it out loud. I love you. Yes, I love you too, just as much as you love me. Your love is not one-sided, nor has it ever been unrequited. For a long time, I failed to acknowledge my own feelings, but I'm here now, with my heart wide open, ready to tell you that I am just as madly in love with you as you are with me. I'm sorry it took me so long to realize the depth of my emotions. It feels almost ridiculous now, looking back, that I didn't see it sooner. You've always held a very special place in my heart and life. I knew I cared about you, but I never truly understood why that care, that affection, and even the protectiveness I felt towards you ran so deep. I thought it was just the bond we shared as friends, but now I know that it was so much more. It was love, real and undeniable love, but I was too blind to see it. I can't help but feel like the biggest fool in the world for not recognizing how much I adored you sooner. How could I not have known? You've always been there, right in front of me, offering me everything, your kindness, your patience, and above all, your love. It baffles me that I didn't realize sooner that you are the person my heart was searching for all along. But, thankfully, I have now. I can't imagine how much I would have regretted it if I had missed this chance, missed us. You are not just the love of my life, you are also my best friend in this entire world, and that makes this love all the more special. I want to apologize, my love, for any pain my ignorance may have caused you. I know you've been so careful not to show your hurt, but I see it now. I understand that there must have been moments when you were deeply affected by my inability to confess my feelings. You hid your love so well, afraid that if you expressed it openly, it might ruin our friendship. I see now how much you sacrificed, how much you kept inside because you were afraid of what my reaction might be. You feared that I would push you away, that I would distance myself from you, and I hate that I might have made you feel that way. Truthfully, you know me better than anyone else on this planet, and because of that, you anticipated my reaction better than I did. If I hadn't recognized my feelings, I might have distanced myself from you. I don't want to think about what that would have done to both of us. I'm just so grateful that you stayed, that you continued to love me in silence and remained so patient with me. Thank you for waiting, for believing in me and for trusting that one day I would wake up to the truth. You never pressured me or made me feel uncomfortable about our bond, and that means more to me than words can say. I don't know if I deserve the depth of love you hold in your heart for me, but I do know one thing for certain, you are not alone in your feelings anymore. I feel the same powerful connection you do, and I want to build on that. I want to make this relationship as beautiful as it can be because it's rooted in something so pure. Our friendship has been the foundation, and now, with love, we can create something even more extraordinary. There is no one in this world who could be more perfect for me than you. I feel incredibly lucky to have someone like you by my side. The fact that you fell in love with me, an idiot who took far too long to understand his own heart, is something I will never take for granted. I love you so much, more than I can put into words. And now that I've finally realized how much you mean to me, I want to spend the rest of my life making it up to you for the time I lost, for the pain I caused you, even if it was unintentional. So here I am, holding my ears in apology, begging you to forgive me for being so slow to understand what my heart has always known. Please forgive me for the hurt I've caused you unknowingly, for the days and nights you spent waiting for me to wake up to the truth. I love you, deeply and wholeheartedly, and I want to spend the rest of my life showing you just how much you mean to me. Love and life are truly extraordinary, every day, they introduce us to something new. 
whether it's a fresh emotion, an unexpected incident, or a unique experience, life keeps us in a state of continuous learning and growth. It's almost as if life has an endless supply of surprises, constantly teaching us lessons and offering us the chance to evolve. Just when I think I've gained a sense of understanding, something unexpected happens, taking me by surprise and challenging my perception of what I thought I knew. It's humbling to realize that no matter how much we believe we understand, there is always something more to learn. I find myself in awe of the precision and perfection with which life unfolds around us. Everything seems to work in harmony, even when we don't immediately recognize it. The more I reflect on this, the more I realize that nothing happens before its designated time. No matter how much we try to force things or push them to happen, life operates according to its own divine timing. This realization is both comforting and profound. There are countless moments that, in hindsight, have taught me valuable lessons about patience, resilience, and trust in the process. It's fascinating how life's timing often brings us exactly what we need, just when we are ready to receive it. The way people come into our lives, play their part, and sometimes leave, is one of life's most mysterious and beautiful aspects. These comings and goings can be difficult to accept at times, but they are essential for our personal growth. Each person who crosses our path teaches us something, whether it's about love, trust, friendship, or even heartache. Every relationship, whether long-term or fleeting, serves a purpose, contributing to the person we are meant to become. This process, although challenging at times, ultimately makes us stronger, more resilient, and better equipped to handle the ups and downs of life. When I take a moment to reflect on the world around me, especially in nature, I am reminded of how powerful the guiding force in our lives truly is. The universe, in its vastness and complexity, is always working in ways that help us grow, evolve, and become more grounded. Nature has a way of teaching us humility. Whether it's watching the steady flow of a river or observing the slow growth of a tree, I am reminded that life unfolds at its own pace. Our egos, arrogance, and stubbornness gradually crumble in the face of such immense wisdom. Life's challenges are the tools that shape us, breaking down our defenses and helping us shed the parts of ourselves that no longer serve us. In this way, life molds us into the best versions of ourselves. I often feel an overwhelming sense of gratitude for the divine power that guides and shapes my life. It's not always easy to see, but when I take the time to reflect, I realize that everything is happening for a reason. It requires a deep level of understanding and awareness to recognize the direction in which we are being guided. God, or the universe, has given us the best of everything, a perfectly functioning body, meaningful relationships, and experiences that help us grow. The intricacy of this design is something that leaves me in awe. How can everything be so perfect, so intricately planned, and so beautifully orchestrated? There are times when we lose sight of our blessings and focus only on the things that aren't going the way we hoped. It's easy to get caught up in the negative, but when we take a step back, we realize just how fortunate we truly are. As human beings, we are the most blessed of all creatures. We have the privilege of living lives filled with comfort, emotions, and experiences that enrich our souls. Just think about it, we get to experience joy, love, heartbreak, and growth all within one lifetime. Every experience, whether good or bad, serves a purpose in our journey. God, or whatever divine force you believe in, has truly blessed us with an incredible life. When I reflect on my own life, I feel nothing but gratitude. I am grateful for this existence, for being taken care of, and for the many blessings that have been bestowed upon me. I have no complaints because I see my life as perfect and beautiful, exactly as it is. 
I am thankful for my healthy body, my supportive and loving family, my education, and the opportunities I've been given to learn and grow. I am grateful for the friendships I've made, the peaceful heart I carry, the food that nourishes me, the clothes that protect me, and the shelter that keeps me safe. It's easy to overlook these blessings in the hustle and bustle of everyday life, but when I pause and reflect, I realize just how fortunate I am. I truly believe I am one of the most blessed people on this planet, and for that, I am deeply thankful. My life is filled with everything my heart desires, and I know that this is a result of the divine power guiding me every step of the way. Thank you, God, thank you for everything.